See, software industry, if you look out now, lost several years. It goes to very high level and going down and peak and then down. Now, what I just you know, realized and you know, analyzed, it has now been stabilized, I can say. Rather than talking about it is in the peak level or it is going into the zero level, that is gone now. If you look out in the even Indian IT industry, the most of the IT companies has been now like you know we can say that it is stabilized like you know top these are the 10 companies these are the top 50 companies these are the top 100 companies that's a kind of structure it has come up now almost all the companies if you look out even the top it companies like tcs infosys Wipro, they are they are doing a fairly good job even if you look out the dollar prices problem and even us is the economy is a problem or in spite of all these things so if you can look out yesterday TCS and day for yesterday infos results and all nowhere it is uh, lacking because one good thing here earlier we used to bank all the IT companies only on the US market but now what is happening is that almost all top giants in the IT market entered into Indian market see Indian market is not so easy market see let me say that 50,000 crores of tenders are getting it ready in various state government and central government in terms of the e-governance project implementation. For the IT projects at various state government and central government. So and you can imagine the kind of business, 50,000 plus crores of fund, which is coming up from the government of India and other government sector. So you can just see that you know, every company is a part of this uh, government space from top to bottom. Now, those who are not in the directly participating in the government, those who are not directly participating in the government, definitely there will be a subcontracting from the top companies and doing some kind of business activities by the small players. Am I right? So that way, what is, why I am trying to say is that those days we used to bank only on US operation. Now, almost all IT companies expanded their wings in other countries as well as our own India itself is uh, spending a lot of money towards the IT development. So that is the reason I can say confidently because of you no, know, it is stabilized, it is going on well and if you look out in the future also, I am sure that and our Indian particularly, IT companies are going to do the best top to bottom. I am not talking about only bigger level, they will be doing the bigger kind of middle level companies, they will be doing their uh, kind of uh, contribution and lower level. I am sure that even the young entrepreneurs can come up with a different kind of strategies and because it is nothing but the talent. IT is nothing but the talent because we have got a lot of talent in our country. So that is the reason where you now the skill development uh, initiative part and all it is taking part where government is spending. Now using this talent and definitely people can come up with a different innovative models and they can be part with the top companies and uh, doing this kind of product development and this kind of services and that's what how even youngsters or young entrepreneurs also can come into this industry. It is a welcoming one and uh, there is yeah, they have to come out with the new innovative ideas. See, for example, Department of Science and Technology is spending a lot of funds to come out with the incubation, technology incubation center. So where we need to cater to that uh, setting up the technology incubation center by the IT companies and then connect that to the various engineering colleges, universities, so that they will come with the innovative ideas. We will take the best innovative one and then we can support for them to start up the kind of you no know, uh, business model. So that way also the government is encouraging. So definitely what they need to do is that I am not saying that everybody after completion of BTEC I wanted to enter into the Microsoft or TCS or Infosys. So only thinking in the more than thinking only in that idea, they can also look out what best they can contribute in terms of the new ideas, new innovative things. And once if they are able to come out, definitely they will be able to succeed even in terms of setting up of their own units. Not only that, no, they have to look for the jobs. Of course, some management skills are all required that definitely they can uh, go through even during the final year itself, some kind of you know, management program, skill set, etc. So definitely they can come out with the new innovative ideas if they are coming out. There is a huge opportunities for them to grow in the our India market. Data analytics is the most now uh, emerging uh, business area, even in India and other parts of the like you know, world, anywhere, US and all. And I am proud to say that Helios and Matheson already entered into the data analytics and we have already in fact backed one contract in US 
and we are going ahead with the data analytics and we are also trying to see that how best we are going to look out in the some of the government department where we wanted to this big data a kind of you know this technology to implement and we are on the uh, that is also on our cards and we are working on so in fact uh, we already initiated in our us uh, this data analytics yes yes all bigger corporates including infosys all tcs everybody and now in fact we are on par with them and working in the us that is the proud to say where helios is into the big data analytics in fact if you look out business india or md has given uh, there was a big article just two months back so more uh, he focused on the data analytics if you can just look out so there is a, if you want i can just send it so more now helios is focusing on the data analytics this is a big data item and uh, there are good opportunities even for the uh, in the terms of careers for the people those who are working and those who wanted to focus on this area there are uh, tremendous opportunities is going to come up in the data analytics all top companies are uh, focusing and in fact we are proud to say we have already initiated for any organization analysis of their data and then know how the business is doing and how what we need to do it's nothing but for mbs definitely it is going to be a very useful one that is the reason maybe all business schools are also looking in towards that so it's a very good uh, uh, coming up like anything this data on that is no doubt about it